Okay, and welcome to part five of the timer project. And this time we're going to be fitting the two output components, which are the buzzer and the LED. The buzzer is a small um, PCB mounted device, so that's just got two legs there. And the LED is on a fly lead which we've manufactured earlier. Okay, so both of these components have polarity, so we have a positive and a negative. For the um, buzzer, it's shown by a little sticker here that shows positive, which aligns with a long leg. So just like other components, the long leg is positive. For the LED, we have, we can check because there's a flat here, but we put our long leg to red, so, and I'd made a note of that earlier, so when I made my fly lead, I made a note that my red wire was positive, so we can fit that. The equipment we're using are the soldering iron, the soldering iron stand, some side cutters, and a small amount of solder. So for the LED, we have LED marked on the screen print and because I know that the red is positive, that can go to the positive connection. I can just move those over and then solder those. Take care here, the, the, the two pads are quite close together take care not to overheat them and also not to cause a solder bridge between the two pads. So if we take a look there and we can see the two pads, so it's these two here and I can use the side cutters as close as possible, cut those off, so there's my fly lead and the buzzer, we've got our long leg here on the PCB, I think you can clearly see there it says buzzer and positive, so we put that there. These legs are quite tough, you can bend them out slightly, don't ever bend them over more than just a little bit, but I'm going to use the same thing which I've done before which is put them on the tool there just to hold them in, they will actually, this one will hold in like that. Make sure the component is down on the board. And using the side cutters to cut off those, they're quite thick legs. And then the small sticker there, which is just to seal it up to stop anything getting into the buzzer is there. So there's our buzzer as far down on the circuit as you can. So we fitted our buzzer and our LED which are the two output components.